Today we are going to make another recipe of Maduris. Today we are going to make hibiscus drink. But this very one is special from my mouth. From the western part of Ghana, we called it Bissau. And when you come to the other side of Ghana, they call it Sobulu. In Takradi, we call it Bissau. So my mother always makes Bissau with different, different, different methods. She can do it in, with different methods. So, I like it very much. So, when I relocated to Tema at my grandma's place, my paternal mother's house, my paternal mother's house in Tema Kuntinai Cemetery Road, and we have a house here. And one afternoon, I was, I wake up and I said, I want some drinks to drink, but I want some local drink. So I was expecting her to mention Ekulemi and also expecting her to say Bisab so again. Then this house herb, now Sobolo is fine. I said, I have never tasted Sobolo. I have never tasted Sobolo. I don't know what is Sobolo. What is for you? You will see. You will like it. Can you tell me the recipe? She said, she can only tell me it's flour and some ingredients. So I asked, which flower? She said, hibiscus. I said, oh, bisab. He said, what is bisab? I said, yes, in Western, that's how we call it. We call it bisab. In the other part of Ghana, they, we call it sobolo. In English, we said hibiscus drink. So if you want to see I'm going to make this hibiscus drink, please keep watching and see you soon. These are the fruits you will need to make your sobolo or hibiscus drink. Apples, bananas, pineapples, ginger, carrots. You can use any vegetables and any fruit of your desire. For the sobolo, we have different types of the petals. This is huintia, black pepper. Sugar is there and the hibiscus petals. The petals, we have different types. I only know the three. This very one, the red one, and the smallest one. Put your water on the stove, pour in all the ingredients, except the sugar or the honey. I wanted to use sugar, but later I switched to different things. So keep watching, you will see what I use during the end. Now let it boil for five minutes on a high heat. Only five minutes. This very one has a very special color that looks like red wine. But this one, I don't have much in the house. But the other one, the one you see it's red, I have a lot in the house because I use it for recalily drinks. So after it's ready, take away the pineapples and strain it with a fine strainer. You can also use a cheese cloth to strain it. Leave small part of the liquid because there is some particles of the petals under. When you fill it, it's not sand. It's just the particles of the 
petals. This is the awning. This is special Swedish awning. So I'm going to use about 250 grams and then stir it till it melts. Now let it stand and let, let it cool down for an hour. Chill it in the fridge. Serve your friends, family, loved ones with this hibiscus drink. Enjoy it. These are the ingredients you will need to make this ginger drink. You can use any fruit of your choice and any vegetables of your choice or your desired fruits. I blend it with smoothie blender on a low speed. Then after I give it a high speed. So that it will blend very well. After I sieve it with wine strainer and a strainer, two different types of strainer, the, the metal strainer and the wine strainer, that is the clothes lying in the bowl. I add cereal. And then I rise it up for the water or the juice to drip into the bowl. You can squeeze it with a tongue. This is what we get. Chilled it in the fridge and set with friends. Enjoy this. Are the ingredients you will need to make the tiger nut milk. The tiger nut must be soaked in the water for 5 to 10 days. The longer you soak it, the softer it becomes. After 5 days, I decided to make the tiger nut milk. Wash and strain the water away. Use hand blender to break it into pieces before you use any blender. It is easy that way. If it is thicker, add water to make it softer and easy to blend. After blending with a hand blender, pour some amount in the blender cup. Add water. Then give a pause, 5 to 10 pours before you blend it. You can blend and sieve it three to five times, but I'm going to blend it only once and sieve it because I need the fiber to do other things. This is the fiber I get from the tiger nut. I will use for another recipe. Now pour in the coconut milk in the tiger nut milk. For the honey, you can use the honey spoon to pick the honey but I'm using a spoon to scoop it out. This is natural honey. Then use the scoop to clean the spoon. Add nutmeg. You can add cinnamon or vanilla, any flavor of your choice. Then stir it gently. Make sure the nut milk and the honey mix well.
after you can pour it into your desired jacks, bottles, cups, etc. Chill this in the fridge and serve this with family and friends. Enjoy this tiger nut milk. are the ingredients we are going to use and the main ingredient is corn crushed corn you can use any corn of your choice so with a clean water i pour in my crushed corn and you can soak it with all that gem inside but i didn't want that so i strain it away so i'm going to soak this for seven days Seven days later, you can also soak it five days. It depends how you want it. And these are the rest of the ingredients. You can use any ingredient of your choice. And this is the corn after seven days. Don't throw the water away. Is the, ma the main water we are going to use is that. And this is the sugar. With a clean saucepan, pour in the corn. In the water you soak seven days ago all of it in the and then add more water it depends how much you want the asana drink add your ingredients and stay stir it gently allow it to boil for 10 to 15 minutes on a medium high heat With a clean saucepan, I add just two tablespoons of water and then add the sugar. It will help the sugar to melt without any smoke coming out. But you don't have to stir the sugar. You can allow it to melt and that is the correct way by I stir it here. After pouring the water from the corn we boiled, Pour it into the caramel you make, but remove it from the heat so that it does not splash on you. Let it cool down. Serve with your desired glass and enjoy this. Cheers. For the chocolate drink, the only ingredient we need is cocoa powder. This is my cocoa powder. Okay, I'm using Oh Boy. And this is lukewarm milk. And this is ice cubes. So first, only one tablespoon into the lukewarm milk and stir. So this is ready the next thing is to pour this lukewarm over this okay this is lunch right perfect lunch so we are My going cheese. to just place on your cheese vegetables then you lay on another cheese okay so then you roll this lunch okay we got this lunch we got this a wholesome lunch just like this oh so guys so i couldn't share with you the full recipe or the fresh yogurt this is homemade. I made it last 
night but i was so tired and i couldn't share but i promise i'm going to share this recipe with you in the future i hope you will like it mm -hmm. 